Aloha Vikings, this is your KBIKS Morning Bulletin. My name is Ashley and here are announcements for Tuesday, November 24th, 2020. Today's schedule is 1, 3, 5, 7. Virtual Christmas Corners. Attention all Vikings. Corner decorating is a, tra is a tradition here at Hilo High and we would like to continue this tradition virtually. This year's theme is Holidays at Home. Participants should decorate their corners in this case your homes, in a way that evokes comfort and shows coziness of the holidays from the comfort of their own home. If you are planning to participate, please fill out the intent form at tinyurl.com slash holidays at home 2020 and visit the school website for full participation information. This form will close on Friday, December 4th at 3 o'clock p.m. All participants will receive 10 hero points. The top winners for each category will also receive a prize and then additional 20 hero points. Should you have any questions, please contact Ms. Schweitzer or Mr. Yamamoto. Class of 2022 Bobo Fundraiser. Hey Vikings, the class of 2022 will be holding a Tifreso Fundraiser on Saturday, November 28th, 2020. Please encourage your family and friends to come to the Yen's parking lot at 235 Wainui Nui Avenue from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. for Depresso specialty drinks and goodies. Proceeds will go to the class of 2022. Thank you. KVEX will be back after these messages. Hey Vikings, as you may already know, Thanksgiving is coming up. In celebration, we will be having a special Thanksgiving grab-and-go lunch on Wednesday, November 25th, from 12.40 to 1.20 p.m. This lunch will consist of turkey with gravy rice, steamed broccoli and carrots, shortbread cookies, and fresh fruit. On that day, from 12.40 to 2 p.m., we will also be collecting any non-perishable or canned food items to be donated to the Salvation Army. Students who donate will receive 10 hero points for every three items donated for a max of 50 hero points. In addition, while supplies last, we will also be passing out pumpkin crunch pies for each car that passes through. Hey Vikings, this Saturday, November 28th, 2020 is National Small Business Saturday. To show our support for our small local businesses here in Hawaii, I challenge you to go to your favorite local restaurant, grocery store, or business to purchase a few items. Make sure you take a picture and send it to hhs.studentassociation at gmail.com to earn 15 hero points. Here are some examples and places you can go to. Let's show our support Vikings. Up next is a video created by the broadcast media students highlighting the culinary program. Let's watch. Um, what is one main thing that you would like your students to take away from this course? Well, Caleb, I think the one main thing I want them to get is um, it's important for them to know about the industry of culinary and all of its related um, careers that are possible. The other thing that I think is really important, so I have to give you two. The other thing that's really important is that our students learn um, and develop a good work ethic so that no matter what career choice they make, they can put those same practices into place. What is usually a class favorite dish that you guys make? So one of the favorite labs or labs that um, the students kind of really enjoy is our Thanksgiving lab. That's one of our first big ones for Culinary One. And they are able to roast their own turkey, prepare and roast their own turkey, as well as bake their own pumpkin pies um, and have some fresh cranberry sauce. And they also do um, a sweet mashed potato and they also have to have some tossed green salads. Oh, sorry, forgot the stuffing. And they make dressing for their turkey. If you're interested in culinary as a career, what CTE courses should students take? So I recommend that they start off with the um, Public and Human Services Pathway Core, and they follow it up then with Culinary 1 and Culinary 2 classes. Sounds good. I guess my last question would be, why should students join culinary? I think that the skills that students learn in culinary are not limited only to the field of culinary, but again, they can use it in any career field that they work with. Um, we, they have the opportunity to learn how to work with others, 
um, and that's a very important skill. Our labs lend itself well to that, and students get to um, do a lot of hands-on practice, which I think they enjoy, and I think we as teachers enjoy working with them in those hands-on lab activities as well. Sounds awesome. If you're interested in signing up for the culinary program, registration will be in two weeks. Now we go to Pono for the menu. Today's grab and go lunch and breakfast. Bagel with cream cheese. Today's grab and go lunch and breakfast is breakfast. Bagel with cream cheese. Thank you, Pono. Remember Vikings, there is no school on Thursday and Friday for Thanksgiving. This concludes today's announcements. Thank you for watching and have a great day, Vikings.